Good morning everybody. Today is Monday and I'm going to just film a vlog of today and yeah, I'm going to update you guys a little bit about what's going on and yeah, just enjoy my day. Uh, right now, I am in endocrinology. Is increasing ATP consumption. Have to make a coffee. Have to make a coffee. So Wow. I learned I needed to get through this class. I cannot without it. Pain. Okay, my endocrinology class is done. I'm going to meet Jenny for a quick little run. And then, yeah, uh, let's see what else this day holds. Some researchers have discovered. Um, we're going to lifting. Filling out our COVID form. Teamworks. Survey. Anybody else have teamworks? Um, yeah, this is our practice of the day. <laughs> Lift done. Now time for philosophy. Right there. Listen to discussions on a reading I did not do, so. Okay, philosophy done. I honestly was zoning out so hard, my brain is like just gone this past week. So I just walked by, that was awkward. Um, another person, people are walking by right now. Um, my brain is just fried and I'm zoning out in all my classes, so that's good. But yeah, done philosophy. I'm gonna go get treatment in like 30 minutes. So I'll show you as much of that as I can. Okay, treatment done. I got Grastins and some other like hip stuff just like band hip work to loosen up my really, really tight hip. And now I'm finally going home. Hello everybody. It's still the same day and I'm finally gonna sit down and update you guys on... Sorry, my camera was just shaking. And update, <laughs> I'm finally gonna update you guys on what has been going on this past week. It has been an absolute crazy mess. So basically I'll just, there's really no other way to say it that our coach left last week. It was exactly a week ago. Today's Monday when I'm filming this. And yeah, basically he just announced to us that he is leaving, he's moving on, he's doing a different career. And yeah, so. <laughs> The past week we have had no coach. We've just kind of been figuring it out, trying to, honestly just trying to stay like sane and just figure out what's next. And yeah, I'm not gonna go into details of what, like what everything is. We don't even know everything. We don't know what's gonna happen. But as far as I know, our program is still good. They're not cut and cross, so that's good. Uh, yeah, it's just been crazy. I've been, I've gone on like a roller coaster. I'm sometimes I'm like, all right, it's fine. Like it's my senior year, anyways. Like there's really nothing I can do about it, and um, I'm graduating anyways. It's not like anything's going to change in that way. But other times I'm just like so low and just like my life is a mess right now and it really is I have no idea what I want to do when I graduate too so that doesn't help um, and sometimes I just think of everything at once and I just get really overwhelmed but which is okay it's fine it's all part of um, college and senior year and all that stress but yeah right now I'm okay um, things are just clicking along but right now we still don't have a coach the only practice we have is lift twice a week. Everything else is just kind of we meet in groups or we run on our own. 
and my high school coach has been sending me some training. It's similar-ish, but the focus is more on quality and the long runs and the workouts, again, similar, but yeah, so that's a new adjustment. Um, uh, oh, what else? So as for me personally, I'm graduating, like I said, this year, so there's no point of me doing anything drastic like next semester. Um, no matter who our coach is, no matter what happens, like I'm staying at Xavier up until the spring, graduating 100%, like no doubt in my mind about that. But my plan originally was to stay at Xavier for fifth year and use my eligibility because I have a whole year of eligibility. And you know, I had a good connection with my coach, I loved my teammates, and I love Xavier, so there was really no reason for me to leave. But now that there's so many unknowns and I just feel like it's almost like a sign for me to move on with my life, I am in the transfer portal. As of last week, I've got a lot of schools that have reached out, but I'm not making a decision anytime like super soon because all this is still really fresh and um, I just like, I wanna make sure I make the right decision for me and, but it does, like, I'm not saying I'm 100% transferring because who knows what happens with this program. That's why I'm kind of wanting to wait it out a little bit, but I just think like, why not transfer somewhere else? Like Cincinnati is not the state for me. I don't wanna be here or Ohio. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm Canadian. Ohio is not where I want to be, I don't think. So why not explore other options and yeah, try out a new state and I have the eligibility, so why not use it? Yeah, that is my big update. Whew. I mean, it'll be an even bigger update when I announce what, where I'm going after, but yeah, it's kind of exciting. There's like there's so many levels to this. I'm like excited for my future, but I'm also really friggin' nervous and just overwhelmed. But, and the amazing, the so awesome is we also don't have an assistant coach right now, so that's why we have no coaches. Yeah, um, go X. All right, that's really all I have to update you guys on for now. Again, I'll keep you updated. And I think I'm just gonna end the video here because there's really nothing else I'm doing with my day. I'm just gonna do homework the rest of the night. So that was a little Monday vlog plus a big update. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy. Stay tuned for more videos and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.